Hi, I'm Stacy from Blue Marvel Cards and More. A lot of people who have bought the Accountability Abacus bracelets have asked just exactly how you go about adjusting them to be the right size for their wrists. Even though each bracelet comes with a little instruction booklet, to be honest, the illustration that shows how to tie the knot is fairly small, so a video might be of use. When you get your Abacus bracelet, you'll find that on one end there is a little tag that says adjust here. So what you want to do is you want to take your bracelet and make sure that it's going to be snug enough that it's not going to move around on your wrist. You want to think about it as being more like a watch rather than as a bracelet. So if I had this bracelet about this tight, it's not so tight that it's going to leave a mark on my arm, but it's tight enough that it doesn't move around. All right. So I'll make a note of just where I want that knot to be. And I can hang on to that and pull it off. It's extremely stretchy, very easy to take off and on. And then I'm going to tie a double overhand knot. So basically, make your loop. I'll take that little paper off. Come up through the loop once, twice, and tie it tight. Now depending upon the type of finishing bead you have chosen, your knot may not quite be large enough to keep it from slipping back through. So I'm going to do the exact same knot a second time. Again, loop it around. This time I'm coming down once, whoops, <laughs> twice, and make sure that that knot goes right on top of the first knot. And I'm going to stretch it so that it's extremely tight. Before I cut it, I want to make sure that it's the right size for my wrist. And it is. So I would then cut that off, put a little dab of super glue on it, and I'm ready to go. Notice that now I can slide the beads and the beads stay in place all day. So I can begin keeping track of my new habits.